No chill, no filter. Take me, bitch! I know different killers with the chrome. I'm like Chipper Jones. I'll be switching hitters. What's popping? What's popping? And what is popping again, y'all? Y'all know what it is, man. It's your big homie MC Ryan Ski, and this here is No Chill No Filter TV late entry. I know, you know what I'm saying, but you know. 420 then followed up by Easter. Hope everybody had a beautiful one as a matter of fact It was a beautiful day although you know what I'm saying I was forced to sit inside and you know, I guess Soak it all in. You know what I mean? I was laid back. Ain't no use to me lying about it um, Yeah, so yeah, this is a late entry of the recap of the April Agony uh, Go Hard or Go Home, Jack City Ballet, shout out to my man, Bank Sock Sosa, GE, everybody who put that thing together, man, I'm telling you, it was off the hook, okay, but you know, the Ducks were at an all-time high, I don't understand, you know what I'm saying, shout out to my man, Mr. Mills, he had a tragedy in the family, you know what I'm saying, and then on top of that, you know, he got hit with another demon, man, and you know, Things happen, you know, when it rains, it pours. I understand that. Nobody knows that better than me. I I, I promise you this. So, <clears throat> with that being said, man, it was only three battles. Uh, the first battle of the evening, oh yeah, first off, let me go ahead and congratulate my honorary member by doing this right here. Oh yeah, man, I have, you know, man, I'm, I'm your co-cameraman, man. I you can, I, can, I, can I present you with something, brother? Oh, yeah, honor, honor, my honorary, this here is the honorary member. No chill, no filter oh, TV. Oh boy! <laughs> Honorary oh, member. Boy, yeah. <laughs> Honorary member. Yeah, man, yeah. My man. Y'all, yeah. y'all, y'all see him, right? Yeah, man, y'all know what the fuck going on, man. Yeah, man. yeah. No chill, no motherfucking filter. In man. real life. Man, yeah, That's man. my man. Six and all the hours, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. Yeah. Oh, I'm gonna fuck you in the Uh huh, yeah. No, my. I'm yeah, that's my dude, Akirion Cartier, had to claim his, you know what I'm saying, his shirt, had to give him one, man, the man been down with me from since day one, man been manning cameras for no no money down, like if I need help, he gonna ask me if I need help, and he gonna take care of his business, I appreciate you fam, that's the reason why you got that, and I got more to give out, you know what I'm saying, don't sweat it, you know, like I said, I'm not here to make money, I'm here to make history, and not to mention, you know, too many people selling stuff, man, I, I'm just, I ain't with all that, you know what I mean, I'm not finna be forcing stuff in your face man but just know if you got one of those shirts anytime i have an event you come through man it's either half off or free so just keep that in mind you know what i'm talking about so with that being said man this here is my recap of the april agony 420 card you know what i'm saying it was only three battles first battle of the night was my man rich porter versus ish Mula. it was fire um both both sides came with that heat. I heard a little bit of recycling. I think I, I don't know. You know, I mean, I, <clears throat> I I've heard things said that I had heard before. Um, I guess said in a different way, but either way it go. You know, once somebody say a bar and it has that that impact, you know, ain't really much you can ain't really much you can do. You know what I'm saying? To 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 relive that moment is what I'm trying to say. I ain't saying nobody bit nothing or nothing like that. It was just, you know, I heard it before. So, I mean, I can't say it was fire. I can't say it wasn't. You know what I mean? I heard it before. That's it. 
So, with that being said, though, you know, both of them came with fire bars, but I had to give it to Ishmula. My man, Rich Porter, don't get it twisted. He was swinging. He was, he was, he was landing haymakers, but the man Ishmula just had... <laughs> Plenty, plenty of those four in them, you know what I'm talking about? And y'all know what I'm saying, man. This dude right here. This y'all means, stand back when I let this thing go. Or I put it on four in them like y'all letting go. Yeah, dog that did that right there. Yeah, he was in the house and he was fired. Um, but I'm not taking nothing from Rich Porter, man. You definitely on your way, fam. You took care of your business for real, for real. And honestly... The reason why I'm doing this recap is for the second battle, man. Oh, my God. Mike G, for real, man. Check this out. If I had anything bad to say, shut my mouth. You know what I'm saying? But for real, for real, it's just like the same the same uh, advice I gave uh, to my man, Shadow the Serious. You know, just control your breathing. You know what I mean? Cause I, I be, I be, I be wanting them, I be wanting them haymakers to hit hard, but it, they don't, they don't have the same intensity when you kind of like, you know, run out of breath. You know what I mean? So just, you know, kind of keep that in mind. You know what I'm saying? And you can pace yourself. You know what I mean? But I know you be. You be so damn, <laughs> I know, man, I, I I know how it is. And then not to mention, you know what I'm saying, you is pretty much under the, the gun, so to speak, you know what I mean? So you got to keep it going. And um, honestly, you was a different type of beast that night. I, I hadn't seen no Mike G like that before. And you know what, you keep that up, fam. You're going to get everything you got coming, for real, for real. Um, I definitely dug it, man. And don't get it twisted, Tom Montana, he was swinging, and he landed a few haymakers, but dog, you just... You was just coming back with them sledgehammers, man. Well, I ain't going to say coming back because you went first and he went last. And let me say this. I know, I want to say maybe about a little over a year ago, I said that the the uh, the one the one rounders those kind of like depend on who goes last. Once again, Mike G, you know what I'm saying, kind of shut my mouth on that, which was, yeah, you know what I mean? The man went first and... I mean, if you go if you go last and you can still remember the first the first round like the first person's round, I mean honestly you you got to give it to the person who went first. You know what I'm saying? I ain't taking nothing from Tom Montana, dog. He came with that fire. He took care of his business, and I definitely appreciate it. You know what I'm saying? But Mike G just came with a little bit too much fire. So with that being said, I gave that to Mike G. Third battle man prep versus Excel. And once again, they said Excel had smoked my man Coogee, right? But, nah. I, I and once again, I'm not finna, like, bring up old stuff, man. That's stuff that everybody else was saying. I doubt if that happened, you know what I'm saying? I'm, I'm saying that it didn't happen. I'm pretty sure that it didn't happen. But, you know, with that being said, Excel versus Prep, once again, man, that dude, Prep... <laughs> His rebuttals was crazy, and I mean, you didn't write none of that, man. That was straight off the top. That was crazy, and I'm talking about, you know, how do you lose somebody in the desert only to to find them in the same instant and give them water? <laughs> you know what I'm saying? That was crazy. Like, you, you was kind of losing me, but then when you came with the punches, it was bananas, man. Like, yeah, fam, that, that, was, that was something special right there, and I, I'm... I would love to see that type of performance again, man. Prep is a different type of beast also. Um, XL, you came with that fire, man, but Prep just had way, way. And I ain't saying he 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 clowned you like that, but he clowned you in, in a certain kind of way, though. You know what I mean? And honestly, man, I, that was just... And trust me, you 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 was, you was firing off, you know what I'm saying? But Prep just had way just... Like I said, dog, just he, he a different type of beast with it. And then, like, that third round with the rebuttals. Oh, my God, man. And, and, and once again, let me speak on third rounds. Going back to Rich Porter versus Ish Moolah, that's going to be a preference on the third round. You know what I'm saying? Because Ish Moolah came with that conscious thing, man. And he let it be known, like, this is what I'm doing right now. Um, you know, like it or not, I'm going to wake y'all up on a couple things. And trust me, being an OG... 
that's one of the reasons why I gave that round to Ishmula because he came, you know, with something different. Um, y'all see it. Y'all see it in the footage. But once again, that's going to be kind of like a preference type thing. Um, you know what I'm saying? People who like conscious type rap is going to love that round. And people who like gun bars and violence, they're going to they gonna, they gonna probably, you know, um, edge it over to my man Rich Porter. So that's up to y'all. You know what I mean? That yeah, That's up to y'all. So I'm going to leave that up to y'all. But me, on the floor... I gave I gave it all to um my man Ishmula. So just to just to you know what I'm saying, give a quick synopsis, man, on that battle. First battle of the night, Ishmula versus Rich Porter. I gave that to Ishmula. Although Rich Porter did handle his business, he uh, Ishmula just he just had a little bit too much I'ma say he had more. You know what I mean? He just had more intensity on his man with them bars for real, for real. Second battle, man, uh Mike G versus Tone Montana. I gave that to Mike G. And man, that was I, I can't wait to get to it. You know what I'm saying? I'm already I'm already doing my editing as y'all see, but that's uh, you know, prep versus Excel since you know that's what that's what was requested of me, so that's what I'm gonna have to drop first. Well, not me, you know, it's gonna be via No Chill, No Filter TV. But of course through Go Hard or Go Home, Jack City Battle League. I don't know what channel it's gonna be on yet, but y'all will you know, y'all know what's up. They're going to announce it or whatever. But in any event, <clears throat> third round, I mean, third battle, you know what I'm saying? Um, prep versus Excel, I gave that to Prep. Prep just prep just had that entertainment, man, and with, along with bars. So it was crazy, man. Once again, shout out to everybody that came through. I'm not really understanding what happened with all them ducks, man. It was people that was there that still ducked. And I mean, what I don't understand is, like, even the people that, you know, that was, you know, that showed up that was supposed to battle i knew that they wasn't battling before them like hoodlum i'm like dog so you're not he, what would you oh man for real dog i'm no he and then you know when he told me that king eight wasn't coming i'm like for real then i see logic divine like okay well you know i guess you ain't what you mean i'm not battling what you talking about <laughs> you know what i mean then i see scotty lyrical and both of them there scotty and fat folks is there and <laughs> fat folks Damn fat folks. You know what? If y'all didn't see the prediction vlog, I'm gonna put just go ahead and check uh click the link below, you know what I'm saying, in the description and, and check out my prediction vlog on this this very, very uh this very um event, the agony uh, April Agony event, you know what I'm saying, four twenty card. Um I had a lot to say and honestly it was kinda like it was kind of like a waste of time. I mean, from all them battles and then only three battles actually happened, man, because people didn't show up or whatever the case, you know what I'm saying? Like I said, I know that it was tragedies in folks' family, so I'm not going to speak on that. Um, you know, I'm just hoping that, you know, everything goes well with, 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 with my mans, you know what I'm saying? And whatever happened with those who, who didn't show up for whatever reason, you know what I mean? I'm hoping that, you know, the next time that this man actually does an event that everybody shows up. And then what I don't understand is when certain people have those type of events, man, it be people outside waiting like they waiting for the school bell to, to ring or something, man. Like, what? so what's the difference between this one and that one? You know what I mean? I don't get it. But, you know, I guess support is support however you want to look at it. You know what I mean? I'm, shout out to my man, Sean Gotti. You know what I'm saying? Um, OG Gotti. You know what I'm saying? He came through. He kicked it with me for a minute. You know what I'm saying? We took care of a little bit of business. Make sure y'all in the house May 3rd. He will be DJing, you know what I'm saying? We're going to have, you know, great performances by, you know, Miss Johnny, Sock Sosa. Yes, Sock Sosa will be there. This is my birthday party. Um, Tomboy, you know what I mean? Um, Art of Impulse, which is her and Caress. Y'all already seen Caress with them legs that just won't never stop. Um, and then, of course, you know, the very beautiful and lovely Nene Rose. You know, that is No Chill, No Filter TV's own um you know she will be performing also so make sure y'all come down 3400 north houghton avenue you know what i'm saying we're gonna be down there doing our thing it's free to get in don't worry about all that but like i said you may have to pay for the food um but that's about it you know what i mean so other than that man this your big homie mc ronski this has been no chill no filter tv and this was my recap of the 420 event man april agony card shout out Jack City Battle League, Go Hard, Go Home, URL, yes, I said that, Ultimate Rap League, yes, Go Hard, Go Home, shout out Sock Sosa, Banks, my man, GE, man, I'm hoping y'all got putting something else together, man, that's going to be even bigger than this one, I'm pretty sure it will be, you know what I'm saying, so, until then, it's your big homie, MC Ron Ski, there's no chill, no filter TV, and I'm about this bitch, peace. Yo!
<laughs> Yo, bunch of followers, it's only right that they get led. Smoke break, step outside, blaze this six. Ratchet, hit X out of nowhere. Hey, big head. <laughs> Oh, man,